Twisters, 2024, a sequel to the 1996 classic Twister, brings back the thrill of storm chasing but falls short of the original's groundbreaking impact. Directed by Lee Isaac Chung, the film follows a new generation of storm chasers battling nature's fury. And while the visual effects are undeniably impressive, the film struggles to recreate the magic of its predecessor. On the positive side, the special effects are the film's strongest asset. The tornado sequences are visually stunning, with CGI advancements making the destruction feel more real and intense. Watching massive twisters tear through the landscape creates palpable tension, and the action scenes are captivating. The sound design also heightens the experience, making the roars of the storms immersive and terrifying. The cast, led by Daisy Edgar Jones and Glenn Powell, give solid performances, but they're insufficient to carry the movie through its weaker moments. Edgar Jones portrays a storm chaser with a deep personal connection to tornadoes, and she brings depth and emotion to her role. Powell, on the other hand, delivers the charm and bravado expected of a leading man, but the chemistry between the characters feels lacking. The ensemble cast does their best, but the script doesn't give them much to work with in terms of character development. Unfortunately, the film's biggest flaw is its overly predictable plot. While Twisters has some great action moments, the story lacks originality and emotional weight. The character arcs feel recycled from the first film, and the emotional stakes never quite reach the levels they aim for. Additionally, the pacing feels off, with a slow start that leads into a rushed finale. In conclusion, Twisters offers thrilling tornado sequences and impressive visual effects, but it doesn't quite capture the heart and emotional depth of the original Twister. The cast performs well, but they're let down by a formulaic script that plays it safe. Fans of disaster movies will appreciate the spectacle, but the film ultimately falls short of being the memorable sequel it could have been.